Welcome back. The coronation is underway at the Westminster Abbey, and this coronation is one for the history books. Yes, and today we are joined by Zoom with British journalist Kathy Hollowell. She's not only covered stories on the royal family, but she's also met several of the royal family members as well. Kathy, thank you so much for joining us. We're very interested to hear a little bit more as, about your career as a journalist, and I'm sure that you've got a lot of favorite memories or moments with the royal family that you might share with us. Uh, well, uh, thank you to that. It actually feels very late in the day. I think <laughs> I've been up for about four or five hours already. Um, well, good afternoon. Well, thanks for being here I almost decided us. to do the Zoom in my pajamas. But um, <laughs> today is um, an, a massively historic day. This, um, this king has waited for a very long time to take his throne. And I have watched him. Um, we are, he's two years older than I am. Uh, the Princess Royal is the same age as I am. Uh, I grew up watching all the little pictures of him. I first met him in his uh, late, no, mid-twenties. And uh, he would, uh, in those days I was blonde and much more Marilyn Monroe-y. And he would laugh <laughs> and joke and say, they only send you because you're blonde. And he had fabulous sense of humor. Uh, in those days, he was action man and, you know, flying helicopters, surfing with dolly birds in Australia and um, commanding a ship. Um, and, and over the years, I've watched his progression with great admiration. Uh, and he is an extreme, he's going to be a superb monarch. He has the people's interests totally in his mind. This is going to be uh, a monarchy of, of service. Uh, when you watch that service today in Westminster Abbey, did you realize that behind that screen was a man with no crown, just a simple white shirt and his, uh, his naval uniform trousers? He didn't have any rigmarole around him. And he was anointed on the head and the chest and the arm with the holy oil. And I, I, I felt a choke in my throat. I mean, this we could not see it, and we could not see it on purpose. We were not supposed to see it. This was between His Majesty and God. And I, I felt that was e extraordinary. And um, Kathy, such special moments there. We know you've been watching the coronation all morning. What else has stood out to you the most so far? Uh, well, my grandchildren are not exactly the same age and ill order as um, the Princess of Wales. And I feel I should write her a letter and say, how on earth did you get <laughs> Louis to keep that still? And I thought that Prince George was spectacular in his concentration for a nine-year-old. Uh, what stood out to me most of all was the Prince of Wales as he moved forward to give his liege to his father. But it's not his father, it's the king. And what must be going through that man's head because he is next in line. And that little boy over there, that nine-year-old, mm -hmm. is the next one after him. It, it's much more than we can understand. It's a thousand years of, um, of monarchy and of duty. And it's people have the wrong idea. They think, oh, well, the royals don't work. They just go around cutting ribbons and you know, having a jolly time. This last week, their feet have never really got off the ground. They have been working all week with different dignitaries from every single country and every religion. And they have been talking to the crowds and look, the, the crowds were 40 to 50 deep along the mall. When we get to as far as the balcony, 
it will be interesting to see how many million they can get into the mall for that. Mm -hmm. I, I was so proud of Her Majesty. Um, I watched her face and it, to be to be crowned as Queen Camilla and to hear them sing Victoria Camilla. Um, what's going through her mind? These are human beings, you know, they're not made of stone. And she uh, was stoic, as was he. And usually he's laughing or he's smiling, but during the whole service, both of them were very passive faced then. Um, but when it came to walking back down, you could see him smiling at friends on either side and 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 that was nice to see and in the coach that gold coach i wear one around my neck that gold coach is spectacular and they've they've made it a little bit better they've made the new leather bindings underneath the coach so it doesn't rock so much because prince philip said it was like being in a wooden canoe at sea made you feel quite seasick so that was much better so much history there. Um, you're talking about the significance of this coronation. What for you personally being able to, to watch this makes this so special? It's a new start. When you looked at the invitation that, that was sent out for the coronation, at the very bottom of that was the green man. The green man um, is the symbol of the beginning of spring, of a new start, of a fresh opening. Um, this is, his sister put it really well, the Princess Royal, who now has another title. She's called Gold Stick in Waiting. If you want to know what that means, he, she is supposed to shield and guard the king. Um, which I think she would do naturally. She always has. But this, this monarchy is going to be about service. This monarchy is going to be about looking after and trying to make the world a cleaner, kinder place. Uh, it's, it's a whole new world. And he knows everything. He's not oblivious to the fact that Britain is in trouble economically and the world is in turmoil as far as war wars are concerned. He is going to try and mend as many bridges as he can. That's part of his job. He will not, well, I hope he won't, be writing what were called the black spider letters to the government. He's very good at writing a letter and telling somebody what he thinks of them. Well, Kathy but, Hallowell, oh, go Can ahead. I just tell you that the Princess Royal said, you know what you're getting. We know who he is. And uh, God save the king. Certainly a historic day. We so appreciate your input. Thank you so much, Kathy, for, for joining us this morning. And stay with Thank us. Thank you very much. I'll go back to watching the rest of it now because the balcony will be coming up soon. Perfect. Well, thank you again. We appreciate it. And